Pizza Army, I salute you. What is up, Pizza Fam? Pi 5. Today, we are jumping into a new game. This time, Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. It is such a cool game. Guys, the physics, the battles, there are so many characters, so many scenarios, so many outcomes. We're gonna line up a whole bunch of different soldiers on each side and we're gonna let them go to battle and see what happens. If you guys wanna see more tabs, make sure, leave a like and a comment below. And also, if you wouldn't mind, chop that subscribe button for us, guys. And without further ado, let's get into it. All right, guys, so let's check this out. This is gonna be really, really cool, okay? So I haven't spent a ton of time with this game, but basically, we're just gonna set up a crazy, crazy scenario and then let both sides go at it. Okay, so we are doing a Renaissance map, okay? I have seen the mammoths and the mammoths are absolutely crazy. So let's start off. Let's put three mammoths on each side. Okay. And guys, totally accurate battle simulator is quite accurate, except that most battles probably didn't have mammoths, but it's really cool that it does. Right? So let's get a chieftain out here. So what do the chieftain look like? Okay. So the chieftain. Oops, we got rid of our mammoth here. We better get our mammoth back. Okay, so the chieftain are pretty cool. Um, let's put a couple chieftain here. And basically, you know, if you put even amounts of units on each side, I think it's kind of going to be like a toss-up of who wins. It might be a little bit like to do with positioning and other stuff like that. So let's just like get this started just to see so you guys can get a feel of like what happens. Let's just uh, give it a go. Okay, so we've got a couple of mammoths just like rolling around on the ground. Okay, so the mammoths are going absolutely nutty. <laughs> Whoa, guys, this is really great. Are you seeing this? I mean, check this out. Look at these two mammoths, nose to nose, tusk to tusk, totally going at it. Guys, blue victory. I mean, how cool was that, right? Okay, use E and Q to move up and down. Okay, so that is a good thing to know. Okay, so guys, let's go ahead and let's get hit this tab button and let's get it started again. Let's add, um, let's add some more stuff here. So it's the Renaissance. Okay, guys, why are we not using Renaissance stuff? What was I using? Okay, guys, I was using tribal stuff. This is, this is not good. We got to do, since we are doing Renaissance, let's set up a little bit of a Renaissance battle, right? So let's get a couple Da Vinci tanks set up. Okay, guys, the Da Vinci looks absolutely sweet. What kind of a tank is that is all I want to know. Okay, so let's get some jousters. We'll get them out in the front here. Um, how about three of them? Okay, and I need to figure out some way to set up some sort of like variation so that it's not such a stalemate. Okay, we've got a bunch of people with long spears and stuff in the front. So we'll put these guys here. So we've got four of them. Okay, that is the halberd. So let's get some musketeers, guys. How about three musketeers? Okay, let's get three musketeers in the back. Because they don't really have much armor or protection. They're just kind of shooting, right? Okay, we've got balloon archers. We're going to get them in the back, too. Okay, what do we got? Four of them. Okay, a fencer. We'll put some fencers here. Okay, guys, this will be the first line here. Okay, I'm not really counting anymore. All right, so we'll just do that. Um, a painter. We'll get some painters. Oh, they're getting awfully close here. Okay, we'll get the painters going. They're going to go at it. Um, and what else, guys? I think that's about it. Okay, I think blue has the slight advantage. What do you say? Three, two, one. Let's get started. Okay. So here we go. Guys, it is chaos, okay? Okay, the Da Vinci tanks are absolutely insane, guys. 
Look at this. I mean, look at what's going on. You can get right in close to them. Oh, that one just lost some of it. Oh, the red ones are just lighting them up, guys. Oh, man. Red won. Even though they were at the statistical disadvantage, they still won. That is crazy, guys. Okay, so I want to see what can we add. Let's add some more musketeers to blue. And let's add one more blue tank. And let's see how fast they decimate. Now, I wish it didn't start off so far up. Oh, the balloon archers. They actually put balloons on their arrows. And they send them into the air. Look right there. Check that out. Guys, this game is so, so cool. Oh, my gosh. Unbelievable. Okay, red is down to Da Vinci and Da Vinci. Blue team won. We knew they were going to win. We still have our musketeers, guys. That was sick. Let's get a new map and start off with some new characters. Okay, guys. Now, this looks really, really cool. Um, I know that Halloween is over, but let's get some spooky creatures out here. Okay, I've seen the Reaper in action, and the Reaper is an absolute monster, guys. The Reaper cannot be messed with. I, I, that's all I'm saying. The Reaper, he's mobile. Okay, the Da Vinci tank is really, really sweet, right? But the Reaper can move and hack and slash. So he is an absolute beast. Okay, so let's put some sword. What is it? Sword caster. Oh, they actually cast swords. Okay, so let's put some more over here. We're going to put some over here too. Guys, this is going to be a battle of epic proportions, okay? I'm saying it is going to be absolutely insane. Okay, so let's put some pumpkin catapulters right here. Watch them load up the pumpkin. Okay, we'll put one here. We'll put one here. So we've got three, four over there, one here, one there. Look at them loaded up. That is sick. Okay, so we've got four there. Okay, vampires. Oh, man, listen to the noise. Okay, we'll put a bunch of vamps, right? Bunch of vamps, okay? I don't know who's got more right now. Um, red definitely has the lead, I'd say. Okay, so that should be enough vampires, all right? Let's get some candle heads. What the heck a candle head even is, I don't know. Can we go down? Okay, can we go down and see what they look like beforehand? Okay, check out the candle heads. Okay, can I rotate? I don't know how to rotate, guys. Check out the candle heads, right? Okay, there's the sword casters. There's the candle heads. Here's the sword casters. Okay, no, these are vampires. My bad. Okay, here's the pumpkin catapults. And the reapers are absolutely insane, guys. Okay, let's come back up. And let's get some more stuff down here, right? How about some skeleton archers, right? We'll get some skeleton archers. Look at them. They're like in their underwear, basically, which is really funny. Okay, let's put a bunch of skeleton archers over here. Um, oh, is that free cam mode? Okay, so I just hit free cam mode. All right, so here we go. Guys, I'm learning this game. I wanted to get right into it because it's really, really cool. Um... Skeleton archers. Also some skeleton warriors, guys. We need some skeleton warriors. These guys are going to be our frontline beasts, okay? I don't know who's at an advantage right now, guys. We are loaded up. Absolutely loaded. Let's get going here, guys. Three, two, one. Um, Actually, hold on. Let me get up a little bit. I want to have a good view and then I'm going to zoom in and try and kind of check out some of the carnage, right? So here we go, guys. I I'm excited to do this. Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, come on. It's way zoomed out so we can't see it. Okay. It is absolute pandemonium down here, guys. Listen. Oh, listen to the sword casters. Okay. This is absolute chaos. Oh, there comes a reaper. Oh, the reapers are coming in. Oh, man. Okay, here comes... I don't know. Uh, skeleton archers coming in. Shooting some skeletons. 
Guys, blue victory. That was too quick. That was way too quick, guys. I don't know what to say. Let's just put out a ton of Reapers and let's just watch them absolutely do battle. Okay, we are Reapered out, guys. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, my computer, it said, yeah, I don't think you're going to get a close look at this because your computer will actually catch on fire. Okay, so here we go, guys. The Reapers are coming in. It's very blurry. Oh, but you can hear the carnage. Oh, my gosh. It is absolute chaos down there, guys. I don't know what is happening. Can we hit super slow-mo? Oh, that's what we need to do. Super duper slow-mo, right? Okay, here we go. Okay, here's a Reaper. What they're up to, I they're hacking and slashing. Can't really see super, super well. Um, we've got a bunch of dead soldiers, I guess you could call them. Okay, the skeleton archers are still there. We still got skeleton archers there. Okay, there is a pumpkin catapult. Um, pumpkin catapult. Oh, the reapers absolutely decimating it. Guys, this, <laughs> this is really cool. We've got a bunch of skeleton archers here, and we've got some reapers, guys. Oh, look at the full moon. Okay, I'm going to come back up, and let's get it going. Oh, man, the carnage, guys. This is insane. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's slow it down. Okay, what is this? Okay, leave toggle. Can I actually use them? No. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to free cam it around. Okay. Red victory defeated blue team. Guys, that is nuts. Guys, look at the carnage. Guys, this was an absolute battle, guys. This was an absolute battle. Tons of Reapers. I think it was the Reapers that probably did it. Okay, guys, that was the spooky map. Let's check out one more map. All right, me mateys. If you think we're getting out of here without a pirate battle, then you got another thing coming. Okay, here we go, guys. This is really, really sick. All right, here's the pirate queen. These are the big boppers, right? Usually the ones, okay, so they all have like a cost, basically. Or like it, it shows how much, I think it's basically how good they are. Okay, so we've got six and six, right? So we've got captains here. Um, we got one captain. We'll put them back a little bit. Okay. We'll get some cannons, right? We'll set them up in the ship. Um, it's going to be tough getting up to those cannons. You're going to be walking up those wooden, like, plank-type situations and just getting absolutely blasted, right? Okay, so we've got some harpooners, guys. Are you guys loving this game or what? Make sure, leave a like and a comment if you want to see more of this game, guys. We have tabs. We have tabs on tabs, guys. We are going to do this. And let me know what sort of battle scenarios you want to see. I am loving this game. Okay, so we have bomb throwers. Let's put them in the back. Okay, I'm going to stick some bomb throwers back here. Some sneaky bomb throwers. And then I'm going to give Red a big advantage. But I'm going to have bomb throwers just waiting. And maybe a couple more cannons. We'll do a couple more cannons up here. But I will give Red the advantage as far as, like, troops. Okay, so we're going to load it up with cannons. Let's see if they can get to the ship. Um, I'm going to put some blunderbusses up here, too. Okay, we're going to have basically the, the firepower, which is probably going to be an advantage for us, right? Okay, a bunch of blunderbusses and a bunch of flintlocks, okay? Bunch of flintlocks. Okay, let's see. Where else can we put them? Okay, now I am going to add a bunch of pirate queens over here and see if they can't fight their way up to the ship. I think they will. Here we go, guys. Oh, this is going to be a good one. Okay, I'm going to free cam it. Oh, guys, look at the battlefield. 
Unbelievable. Okay, here we go. Look at this battle. Oh, man. Okay, Red's going to have their work cut out for them if they're going to make their way up onto this ship. Oh, they're getting lit up. Oh, they're getting absolutely lit up. Holy smokes, guys. Look at this. Okay, look at Blue. Oh, Blue's getting hit hard, too. Oh, man. Red might have this, guys. Oh, the cannons. They made their way. They breached. The ship's been breached. Oh, my gosh. Red's going to do it by overwhelming margins, guys. Red has this one. Unbelievable. Guys, unbelievable. I thought Blue might have it by putting all the ammo and the artillery on the boat and making Red kind of fight their way up. But Red had it, guys. And how cool was that, guys? That was so much fun. Those battles were so, so cool. Make sure to like this video if you guys want to see more totally accurate battle simulator. Also, guys, if you wouldn't mind smashing that subscribe button. Until we see you in the next video, guys, I really appreciate you stopping by. Take care, guys. High five. Bye-bye.